Hello everybody, this is Daniel Luz from China Gadgets Reviews. In this short video I'll show you how to update the firmware on Vigiga P3S Android TV Box. This one with Amlogic S805 quad core processor. Okay, so first of all you have to download the firmware from my website and uh, copy all the files from inside the archive on a micro SD card. Okay. Insert the micro SD card into the Vigiga TV box. Then you have to connect to plug the power in the into TV box. Okay. And now we have to wait for 20 minutes to start the flash of the new firmware. Just wait. Okay. As you can see, the system is installing the new update. So, it's so easy. I tell you one more time, just download the latest stock firmware from China Gadgets Reviews. Then you have to uncompress the archive, copy all the files on your micro SD card. Then unplug the power from the Vigiga TV box, insert the micro SD card and then plug again the power. You have to wait about 23 or 30 seconds and you'll see this screen installing system update. Here you have to wait about 3 or 4 minutes and the process will be finished. Okay, so it's that simple. When it's done, the system will reboot and you'll have to to take off the micro SD card, not to repeat this process again. Just wait to finish here. Okay, so. So, I took off the micro SD card, the system will reboot with the new firmware, the latest one. Okay. So, that's it. It's very, very simple. First boot normally takes longer, so you have to be patient.
just a few seconds. Okay. First setup next. Choose the language English. Like this. Okay. Let's take a look in settings. So, this is Android KitKat kernel version 3.10.33. Vigiga P3S. Android TV box. Let's take a look about media box here. And this is the build number. Okay, from 7 July this year. Okay, thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye.